Our top story this hour, one man was killed, three others wounded in a shooting that happened in Austin. Judy Wang is live at Stroger Hospital this morning with details. Judy. Good morning. These Austin victims are among 17 people shot since Friday evening. A 29 year old man was killed. Chicago police say there were multiple shooters in this overnight incident. Four men were standing outside when gunfire erupted in Austin just before midnight. Chicago police say three gunmen approached the victims at Lockwood Avenue and Huron Street and opened fire. The man killed had been shot in the head. A 40 year old was shot in the hip and leg. Another man also in his 40s was shot in the leg. Both of them are in serious condition here at Stroger Hospital. A 62 year old suffered a graze wound to his back. He was brought to Stroger Hospital in good condition. Police say the shooters may have taken off in a gray Nissan. With violence surging, the city is awaiting federal help to arrive. The Justice Department is sending a strike force to Chicago to help go after drun, uh, gun traffickers. President Biden discussed his strategy with Mayor Lori Lightfoot at O'Hare before he headed to Crystal Lake last week. Police Superintendent David Brown joined major city police chiefs and mayors at the White House Monday where the president talked about gun violence. Brown says the flow of illegal weapons into the city is a major factor. CPD has seized more than 6,000 guns so far this year. The mayor has also proposed starting a $1 million reward fund for tips about illegal weapons. In the Austin case, none of the gunmen is in custody. Outside Stroger Hospital, Judy Wang, WGN News.